So hi everyone. This is a giant box and I'm sure you can tell what it is by looking at it if you follow Simply Gilded. But this is the 12 days of Simply Gilded that I kind of took a peek at already. It's a giant, very giant box. I will take all these things out. But the package, of course, is very beautiful. And mine is in pristine condition because I ordered a lot from Simply Gilded since around October. The customer service was so great, actually, because international shipping is extremely expensive. I was able to request that they hold some of my packages and so I ended up getting this in a giant box just it didn't go through the international mail system like uh, this like naked box didn't go through it and so I was really grateful that first of all they helped me save a bunch of shipping costs and also that I was able to get some of my things in better condition than usual so this box for 12 days of simply gilded it did arrive early january i think for me but it's very pretty anyway and you can turn the box the entire box around so that this like printed part is on the outside but we're not here for the box I think a lot of people have seen what this is already. I would show it for a Washi Wednesday. So let's get started. So the theme this year is like a double theme. I think there's like a fairy, like sugar plum fairy, but then also with a kind of enchanted Rapunzel theme. I like the colors and I have gotten the advent calendar or the 12 days from Simply Gilded since the beginning. So it kind of felt like I, I still wanted to continue that tradition. I'm not sure moving forward if I'll be able to get them for now. Here is the, the kind of color scheme and theme. So day one was in this cardstock sticker folder. And these are the stickers that were inside. So first you've got a moon kitty basic icons with gold foil then this sugar plum fairy deco sheet also with kind of this gold foil this one is bows and ballet with the juniper and the jasper it's very pastel also with gold foil a bunch of these floral moons but maybe this is a different kind of gold oh the paper seems different oh yeah it's the clear plastic paper. It's interesting. This one is the sugar plum fairy bows with that overlay. You can see. This one is weird. Sea friends. I guess it colors on theme, but it's weird for the theme. This one also has that holographic iridescent over. It's not holographic, it's iridescent overlay. And this one is Sugar Plum Bookshelf. Oh, I like this one. This one says, I love stationery. I love this one, actually. And then the last one says, is uh, called Presents. And this one is, uh, again, very pastel. So definitely my favorite sheet of this one is this. I like that one a lot. So that was day one. Day two, oh, and they all came with most of them came sealed. Deal doesn't always stick because there's a lot of stuff in these. This one has nice design on this. And it, these were the three that were in my envelope for day two. So you've got like um, a blue mash, mush, magical mushroom. This one with butterfly and a bow. And this one is rose gold foil. This one looks like silver holographic foil. And then this nice one is purple background with rainbows and rose gold butterflies. That was day two. Day three is a flat envelope. And... Oh. 
you got the card so it's blank on the inside but it says you make the whole place shimmer and you get a seal plus an envelope it's like a hot pink color and then the sticker kit this one is rose gold in the sticker kit you end up with the date dots these are heart icons get a deco sheet and then these are the full boxes a lot of these themes are coming through now from the day two washi and the color scheme is very on point so those are the date the date covers you get four weeks of date covers and then this is like the mini deco and flags checklists and then these are the box like the half boxes and the mini ones yeah irene was talking about this like being like super shiny foil day four is this box a lot of people thought this was going to be one of those juniper figurines that ended up being clip which is like kind of like fairy wing clip and a roll of this like pet tape thing that i think is going to be really interesting with this is they are completely kiss cut every single one is a little individual sticker and it also has the overlay so there's a lot going on here but this again matches perfectly with the sticker kit i just showed and the washi tape so it looks like the loop is pretty short though the entire loop is um, like right here so that's it for the loop so you get a lot of stickers but not a lot of designs like there's a lot of on the roll but mm, definitely my first time with pet tape that is already cut out which i think will be very useful but also simply gilded's first time featuring pet tape day five is a paper product it is the like a weekly notepad and you've got Saturday and Sunday right here so it's like this off-white color um, and I think it's also rose gold and it's foiled day six a big one a big package this nice really nice like um, rainbow design oh this one is really pretty so this one is the photo size album which is the middle size album and i love this this is like their iridescent such a nice such a nice color i like this a lot i think probably we'll have other other sizes coming out for this oh and then here's the bow that goes with it the bow charm okay day seven is in this and probably pen yep oh oh so it's washi it's the oh i love this one it's the purple foil and what is this one called i don't remember the actual name of this but i love the combination of this like periwinkle and the purple foil purple holographic foil is so pretty and the pen has all of the designs like the butterflies and the floral designs with the ombre this is a pretty one and again this is the rose gold like pink rose rose pink kind of hardware i do find with these like lacquer pens they wear out pretty easily no like the paint wears off and then day eight is it like busted open on the side for me so day eight was more washy and i think this is the last 
of the sugar plum fairy theme. So these are the sugar plum fairy tapes that kind of all go together. So let's see, like that. And then the pet tape. So day eight was the library and this rose gold kind of whimsical butterfly. So that was, and then also there was a little scrunchie not really a scrunchy user but that was day eight not the whole thing this this was day eight and this one's gonna be really pretty because it's like an ombre of that those colors and then day nine is more washi oh maybe this is the end then I guess that goes together so you've got the kind of shattered pink foil with the ombre of colors. I wonder if this one came in different ombre variations. And then you've got a man, um, the mandala washi, which has the silver. This one doesn't seem to go with the rest. Like that, even with that kind of foil, Still kind of goes in the same color scheme but this one doesn't really that's day nine washi and there is a little that's very strange to me yeah i see a coaster in here mine has a little speck of dirt oh no this is very like very soft but i don't really get it why why the two different colors like it has a similar similar finish but this one seems weird that's the coaster and then day 10 is about to bust open as well oh, day 10 is more washi and this washi is starting off the next theme, which is that tangled theme. So you've got the, and these are pretty, the lanterns. And then you've got lanterns and landscape with a castle in the background, uh, a bunch of florals. And then this one is like a sunburst. So looks like, I think it's gold holographic foil and then you also get a rainbow patch like that that's, that's very cute and then day 11 this is my this is probably my favorite envelope the florals landscape that matches this it says never stop dreaming so basically this is what would this is what it would look like. You've got the boats and the lanterns in the sky. It's a nice overlay on that. And it has the postcard on the back. And then this one says, shine like starlight. It's got this sun symbol. This one is like a shiny gold. It seems like a deeper gold than the champagne gold that she normally comes out with. So again, this ombre of date dots, the deco, which is, says Rapunzel on it. These are the full boxes. Date covers. Flags and deco, and then the half boxes. And then the last day, day 12, comes in this really beautiful pouch that seems quite nice with a little bow on top and it is a bag it's got the simply gilded scallop and it's kind of like that rose rose pink rose gold I've only used this still for 
stationary items or you can totally just use it as a regular bag. So that is all 12 days of the Simply Gilded, 12 days of Simply Gilded. That's like their advent and I thought it was interesting. Lots of washi. I really liked say my favorite item is probably hard to pick actually like I like everything it might have to be the washi I really enjoyed the all the washi I love simply gilded just for washi tape so or mostly for the washi tape so but this album is also really beautiful I kind of wish more stuff was in this foil like in this like if this bag was like this but I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing of all the stuff that was in the Simply Gilded box. That's it for Washi Wednesday. Let me know if you also got this avid box, what your favorite thing was. And I will definitely catch you in my next video. See you later. Bye.